Hello, today we will review and connect the Micro Tick Not LL8 kit router to Car IoT Cloud. The Not LR8 kit is a turnkey IoT gateway solution for LoRa technology. As you can see, the set includes a Micro Tick router and a power adapter. Not is a flexible and convenient solution for creating an IoT ecosystem. This router has the following parameters. Number of processor cores 1. Nominal processor frequency 650. Switch the chip model QCA9531. Routeros license 4. Operating system Routeros. RAM size 64 MB. Storage size 128 MB. Now let's pay attention to the device interface. The device has one microspeed connector, one nano SIM connector and two Ethernet ports. The router also comes with mounting bolts. a microspeed cable and a DIN rail mount. creating the solution. Go to the Car Cloud and select the Solutions tab. Create a new solution and name it. For example, we will name the solution Microtic. Go to Car Cloud, Device Management, Applications. Choose your application. Specify the application version. For example, we will use version 1. Copy and save the application version. This value will be used to configure the router, so it is important to save it. Next, go to Car Cloud, Device Manager, Devices. Create a new device in this dashboard. For example, we will name it Microtic Router. Copy and save the token value. This value will be used to configure the router, so it is important to save it. Connecting to Car Cloud. Open the Microtic Admin Panel Winbox. Log into the Microtic Admin Panel. Open our text tutorial. Open the Winbox Administrative Panel and run the first command from our tutorial in its terminal. In this code, we need to substitute the save token and apps version values. Copy from the tutorial and run the following command. Here you also need to enter the required values. Run the following command. Go back to Car Cloud, Device Manager, Credentials, Basic Credentials. Click the Get Root Certificate button. Copy the received certificate. Go to your computer desktop and create a document in the .txt format. Paste the certificate into this document and save it. Change its name to K and its extension to .pem. Go to the Microtic Admin panel and find the Files tab. Click the Upload button. You need to find and select a previously saved certificate. To export a certificate, run the following command from the tutorial. 
The next step is to execute a command that adds a new MQTTT broker. After that, run the following two commands one by one. You can also find them in tutorial. The following command is responsible for sending a basic JSON message. Here you also need to enter the required values. Repeat the step and run the next script with the required values. Run the last command from the tutorial to complete the setup. Data visualization using dashboards. Go to Car Cloud, Home, Solutions. Choice your solution, Dashboards. Create the endpoint metadata widget in this dashboard. Go to the settings of this widget and find the data source section and select your router in the drop down menu. Go back to the Router's Administrative panel, find the System tab and select Scheduler. Create a new schedule using the command on the screen. In the Scheduler settings, specify the parameters you see in the video. And then click the Apply and OK buttons. Now you need to navigate back to the Car Cloud Platform tab and save any changes you've made. Congratulations. You have successfully connected your Mikrotik router to Car Cloud. Thank you for watching. Build your smart space with Car.